right. Hello, everybody. Travis Chandler, Chandler Gaming, back with the next episode of Mass Effect 2. Last episode, we went on a collector ship to mine some data, have Edie mine some data. So I'm going to have to load game here because I kind of screwed up here. Um... Which was yesterday. Okay. So we need to do this one. Okay. Yeah, I screwed up with the recording. I, I meant to do this episode. I was trying to do this episode yesterday, but I screwed up with the recording. So, um, got to do all the stuff I did yesterday again. That's okay. That's okay. I wanted to do it a little different anyway. You had me so worried when you were trapped on the collector ship. Thank goodness for Edie. That sounds like more than just professional concern, Kelly. You're more than just my commander. You're my friend. Edie brought you back to me. If she had a body, I'd give her a big hug. I'm standing right here. Where's my hug? Oh, shit. <laughs> I wish there were time to get to know you better. Why don't you join me in my cabin for a meal? It would give us the chance to talk. That sounds wonderful. I've been hoping for some private time with you. Lead the way. Okay. You know they were getting nooky up there. Goodness. I haven't stayed up that late since my college days. I had a wonderful evening. Thank you, Shepard. Now, if you talk to Kelly again... I noticed the fish tank up in your cabin. If you'd like, I could feed your fish while you're away. Yes, I would. I appreciate that, Kelly. It's my pleasure. Anyway, what's up? Is there anything I should know? You have unread messages at your private terminal. Anything else, Commander? That'll be all. I'll be here. Commander, you've received a new message at your private terminal. Okay. Pretty much the Blue Sun's ambush site has been detected by Cerberus Command. They want us to go deal with it, so we'll deal with that later. Corporal Tombs from the first game. We uh, found him holding up Dr. Wayne and he, we end up let, we end up killing Dr. Wayne for him. He's like, what the hell? Cerberus was the one that did all those experiments to me and now you're working for him. Fuck you, I'm going to kill you the next time I find you. And Leslie is one of the um, female survivors from Planet Aya where we found uh, Jacob's father. And um, she's getting better now from the neural decay, and she wrote me wrote us a message saying thank you for the help. All right. Now we're just gonna do some missions, and I need to go around and get some um, resources. So I will be back when I find resources, and I'll be back when I if I find any. Um, if I find any missions looking for resources. Anomaly detected. Okay, so here's a hidden um, mission we can do. We gotta scan for it to find it. Where are we at? Oh. There it is. Scans have found something. Oh, God. Oh, this is the one where we have to save the colony by reenacting the shields or something like that. That's right. I forgot about this one. I'm gonna switch out this rifle because I don't really like it. I don't like that it's a three round burst. So we bypass this to lower the shields so we can get through. Oh shit. I screwed that up. 
I wasn't paying attention. There we go. These ones that are mandatory, they give you another chance at them because you have to do them. Whereas if you find the ones with credits, they don't give you a second chance. Okay, now we got the shields down. Now, we need to activate this one. Then we activate this one. And then we activate this one. So it's left, right, and then center. And that's how you activate the shields for the colony. A simple little mission get a little bit of credits that's all you get for that one but hey you know free credits I need the credits for where we're going we're going to a hub world here soon so being Kelly is feeding the fish now I no longer need to worry about the fish so here we go so now I'm gonna just look at the other planets see if there's any resources I need to get from them and I will move on to the next uh, group of planets and see if there's missions or resources I need and I'll be back when I find another mission. Anomaly detected. Alright, here's another anomaly detected. But we're gonna look. Ooh. We'll take this. Okay. Scanners have found something. Is this the one where we have to follow the um, mech and have it like blow up a bunch of rocks and shit? I think it is. Miranda. We haven't brought Kasumi out in a long while. Let's get her out. Um, I'm going to max out overload. I'm going to do heavy overload instead of area. Because I don't really see where area would help. We want to max shadow strike for, um, we're going to give, um, Kasumi the rapid shadow strike because it reduces the cooldown by 80% if the target is killed by this power. And then we'll do her flashbang. And then we're going to save Miranda's. I'm going to change that rifle to the Manus, because I like the Manus a little better. Because I like single shot instead of the three round burst, like the incisor has. Because you end up wasting ammo. Yeah, I thought this was the mission where you follow the. I have resources buried deep within the canyon walls. Heavy explosives will be required to excavate them. All right, data pad. Um, pretty much this one's saying, "Oh, this mech is a piece of shit. It just runs on its own and it leaks power like fucking crazy. So you have to follow it." You have to follow it and keep putting power cells in it. And there's power cells on the path that you're supposed to take, so... So here we go. The 
pick up this power cell. Insert it. What's it firing at now? See, this is so malfunctioning, it's actually shooting backwards. I don't know if this was meant to be a thing, or if this is a glitch, I don't know. But, um, I don't ever remember it acting like this in the original, Mass Effect 2. Now, I believe there's a power cell over here, there is. Right here. Yeah, I don't remember the mech acting like this in the original Mass Effect 2. So, I don't know if this was supposed to be an update or what. I mean, I know Mass Effect Legendary is an update to the series, but... Hmm, okay. Where's the power cell? Is it up here? We're compromised! <laughs> I thought I could get the second one. Got his ass. Barely, but I got his ass. <laughs> I um, don't know where the power cell is. Right here. Okay. Wait. Oh, just a pistol. Okay. I'm like, what? You don't have the right um, SMG on? You do. It's just you're using your pistol. Okay. Why are you going this way, dumbass? I mean, I get it, it's a malfunctioning mech, and that's what it would do in real life, I guess, but I think these game developers, they take, they blur the lines between real life and a video game, you know? They don't need to make these games realistic, they really don't. That's why I love, I love playing, um, Plants vs. Zombies Garden Warfare back in the day on my PS3 because it was a fun little uh, multiplayer shooter you know it, it didn't it wasn't realistic it was cartoony and it was fun you know isn't this where he blows up I think it is Yep, it is. Cool. And all this just for some freaking resources. That's all. That's all this is. All this just for 5,000 platinum. <laughs> yeah, all that just for freaking 5,000 platinum. What the fuck, man? Talk about a worthless fucking mission right there. Nope. Okay. So, we're gonna go back to that planet. Whichever one it was, I think it was this one, and we're gonna get the resources because it was rich. So I'll be back when I find another mission. And here's where we're going. Anomaly detected. 
Ooh, there's some Ezo. If you find Ezo, take it. Because it's rare. There we go. I have found something. Okay, and here's the um false distress distress beacon that the blue sun set up just so they could get more slave labor, and we're gonna put an end to it. So because they're blue suns, we're gonna bring out Zaid. Because we haven't brought him out in a while anyway, so I need to check on him anyway. Um yeah, we'll do Inferno Grenade with him. Okay. Manus. And yep. Yeah, okay. Okay. They've seen us. Well, they have seen us. Well, and I just took him down. Boom, took him down. Oh, I missed him. Now let's finish you off. I headed him off too much. Got his ass. Uh. There we go. <laughs> we just took those fuckers down like they were nothing. <laughs> that was cool. That was cool. The shuttle just landed outside the southern entrance. Get out there and take them out now. Well, we just took out your boys, bro. <laughs> I'm a hell of a sniper, let me tell you. Concerns over employee safety. The Brunfeld mining facility has been closed until further notice. Yeah. Taking cover! Mitchell put him down! Down you go. Down you go. Down you go. Got his ass right in the head, too. <laughs> I'm a hell of a sniper, aren't I? I missed a few times. I, I did. I missed a few times, but... Um... But really, I'm not a bad shot with a sniper rifle. Practice a little bit more, and I, I get really good at it. The thing you want to realize with sniper rifles, um, if you've ever watched The Patriot, there's a scene where um, Mel Gibson and his two kids are shooting at um, Redcoats in the woods. And um, he says one thing that's very important about shooting, aim small, miss small. That jerk Selim just fired me for no reason. I swear the guy has it out for me. I hear the Blue Suns are hiring people to take out some dumbass vigilante on Omega. I'm gonna go show them how it's done. Wish me luck. So, about sniping, I mean, it, that's, it rings true. Aim small, miss small. So, I mean, sometimes, yeah, yeah, it'd be cool to get all headshots, but, um, 
at the same time, sometimes it's better to just, um, get body shots instead. Yeah, see, I thought he was coming. See, if I would if I would have waited on that shot, I wouldn't have missed. There we go. Oh, there's more. I thought that was it of them. I headed him off too much. Got his head. All right, cool. See, I like this Manus a lot better than the Incisor. I mean, the Incisor, it does more damage, but it has a three-round burst, and I'm not a fan of the three-round burst. That, and it has recoil like fucking crazy, where this one, the recoil's not as bad, so... I know the next character in this series will probably be a uh, um, infiltrator because I so want to do sniping only, you know. Or a soldier. I mean, soldiers can use any weapon. Major Hall coming in from that dig site, boys. Move all the unsorted cargo to the mines to make room. Whoever you are, you won't make it out of here alive. Oh shit, we got two of them. We've been spotted. Miranda take that son of a bitch down. Where's he at? There he is. works. Incoming. Let me find a good spot here. Here's a good spot. Ugh. There we go. Firing an impact gun. Can't get him from there. There we go. There we go. Yet. Now. There's a computer to activate. It pretty much tells you Commander Santiago's um, dealing with all this. He's the head of the Blue Suns. They found a Prothean artifact. And, um... They pretty much transported it somewhere. And what the Blue Suns were doing, they were... They set up that um, false distress beacon just to lure people here because they thought... People thought there was somebody in trouble 
and um, the Blue Suns were kidnapping them and forced them into slave labor, slave labor. And so we shut down the we're shutting down the beacon so it doesn't happen anymore. I have heard if you deal with all these Blue Sun um, missions that in Zaid's mission it makes the Blue Suns weaker. I have heard that, but I don't know how true that is. It would make sense if it was true. Okay, and that's it in here, just the beacon? Yep. Okay. That did it. It sure did, Miranda. We leveled up because of it, too. Okay. Next mission. We got this uh, galaxy all explored. But now there's a missile attack we need to stop. Which once we get into the system we'll read our messages because I'm sure there's tons of them by now. Alright. Oh, there's only four. Edie has discovered um, that there's a, a planet under attack by Batarians and there's missiles heading to it. And there's two missiles, but we can only kill one. So we'll do that mission here soon. Um, here's a little uh, cute... Um, spam message. Oh, uh, we have some Prothean technology here, and if you want it, just pay us 20,000 credits. Just a cute little thing they did. Um, here's another cute little spam um, message. You know, it's just whatever. Shorbin from the um, from the first game, where we scanned the keepers, he found, oh, um, they are um, guardians of the um, of the Citadel, and they might have been the very first race to ever use the Citadel. And the Reapers ended up um, enslaving them into caring for the Citadel. Okay. So we're gonna stop the missiles real quick. I have detected an anomaly. Right there. All right. So now we need to take out the Batarians that have taken over this missile base and stop the missiles. Um, we haven't taken out Jack in a while. Let's bring her out. We need nine, which would put us at 30 if we maxed out pull. Yeah, we don't need to max out pull. We don't really need to max out warp ammo either because we already did. That's why I'm using it. So. All right. Warning, two missiles 
someone got their asses shot up out here. Okay. Oh. Ah! No scope his ass! <laughs> I no scoped his ass. <laughs> of course, I was standing right next to him, but oh well. Still, no scoping with a sniper rifle. That's impressive. <laughs> yes, we are aware of an ambush. There we go. Nice job! Nice one. Oh, I didn't quite... Nice! Nice job! Need to find a good spot, that's my problem. Got his ass. I'll kill you all. Ah, I was too slow on that one. Boom. Got his head. Okay. Okay, so now we hack the kill switch. If they would give me the one I need, there it is. Yeah. Okay, so the spaceport, industrial district, apply the kill switch to protect alliance interests and tactical vi viability, albeit at the cost of hundreds of city, hundreds of lives in the city. Or, um, missile two, the capital city, apply the kill switch here to save the city and hundreds of lives with its industrial area destroyed, however this colony will no longer be viable and will have to be evacuated. So we're gonna save the state, the spaceport, because we need the technology. That did it. Which is unfortunate, but what else can we do? Okay. But we can repopulate the colony, so... Alright, well I'm gonna finish um, exploring this galaxy and then I'll see about doing the next mission. So I'll be back when I find the next mission. Detected an anomaly. Here's an anomaly right here. There it is. All right. 
I have found something. All right, a merchant freighter has crash landed here. We're gonna find out what happened. We're gonna play murder mystery here, I guess. I don't know. We haven't brought out Jacob in a while, so let's get him out. X. Boom. We'll pull field for you. There we go. We'll do your barrier. Oh, is this the one with the magnetic storm coming through? I think it is. I think it is. A sandstorm is approaching from the northwest. Proceed with caution. There is stuff here, and you just gotta find it. Is it up here? Take the salvage. There it is. Navigator's log. Short range sensors just went offline and I'm locked out of helm control. The VI is reporting malfunctions all over the ship. do that. I wanted my shipping manifest. It tells you what they were shipping. 14 crates of reflective mech armor came from Jahari Station and the destination was the ERCS facility. Also got 180 Loki mechs. Came from the Hanner had an experimental mechanics division go into the ERCS facility and one YMIR mech head into the ERCS facility. That'll be important in a minute. Just trying to keep my skills sharp, that's all I'm trying to do here. Oh, a heavy Mac. Boom. 
That's how you take out those max. We've been spotted. So. That's pretty impressive shooting right there. We need to leave. That was pretty impressive shooting right there. <laughs> shooting blind like that? <laughs> Alright, so now I'm just going to click on the planets because I don't really need resources anymore. Because I've got plenty now. But I am going to check messages real quick. Um, the Corsica. We're, we need to look at Corsica. So now we have a new mission. So we'll take a look at the abandoned station later once I get this uh, galaxy checked out. So just click on the planet and leave because I don't need any resources. I've got plenty now, so... Okay, so we're ready to go to Jahar Station to figure out what went down here. We haven't had Brun out in a while, so let's get him out. We're going to save his points for fortification. Uh-oh, everyone's dead. Okay, so something went down. The VI is going crazy, is what's pretty much going down here. Docking area power restored. Intruders are requested to report to the cargo doors for immediate removal from station. Okay, that's the way out, right? Yeah, that's the way out. Okay. Intruder detected. You are not authorized to be in this area. Yeah, shut the fuck up. We're in it anyway. Okay, so this is easy to do. Engaged. Testing area has been locked down according to protocol M29-2. Reflective armor prototype repositioned. Reflective armor prototype repositioned. Reflective armor prototype repositioned. Testing area has been unlocked. All personnel take this opportunity to leave the station immediately. Okay, so that was easy to do. You just had to destroy that little thing using the beam. Okay. Attempting to reach the maintenance controls will most likely result in serious injury or death. Don't worry about your squad if they go down. 
because they're stupid enough to walk through it, so I'm not going to waste the metagel. Yeah, I'm not wasting the metagel on these people. If they're going to be stupid enough to walk through it, then it's their own damn fault. Require more power to escalate defenses. Maintenance area power restored. Boom. All right, and then we go to the next area. Which that one's gonna be the toughest one because it's a puzzle. All personnel. A hostile presence has been detected. Please do not interfere with defense procedures. Yeah, this one's the toughest because it's a door puzzle. And you'll see why when we start doing the door puzzle. Okay, so pretty much they're saying these mechs are out of control because they came from a certain facility. Living area power restored. The living area doors have been closed to quarantine a threat to this station. Advise intruders to engage self-destruct procedures to avoid death by starvation. Three doors enabled. Three doors enabled. Two doors enabled. Five doors There we go. We got it. Huh. That was just me guessing. I had no fucking clue how to do that. I always get confused with this one. Wow, I got that first try. I can't believe it. <laughs> Okay, so now that we've got power restored to the station, now we can go into where the VI is. All intruders intentionally violating quarantine are requested to exit the station immediately. Hub area power restored. Central mainframe access granted. Docked vessel detected. Attempting to... Intruder detected. You are not authorized to be in this area. Shut up. This is a secure zone. Please leave this station immediately. I regret to inform you that all attempts to defend the station have failed. Shutting down security protocols. Okay. So we shut down the station. Okay. Okay, so Edie figured out where the uh, virus came from. It came from the Titan Nebula, so we need to go there to finish this mission off. Which is where we're going to go next. But we need to get back to where the uh, mass relay is. Booyah. positive of doing all these, um, all these, um, optional quests is you get money. You get money and you find upgrades, you know? Luckily, there's only one planet here, and it's this one. Anomaly detected. Okay. It's a rich planet, too, but we don't need the resources here. But I'll take these if I find them. There we go. Alright. So now we're going to shut down the facility that made these rogue 
um, Max. And it's gonna be fun, too. So, um... We'll bring Morden this time, because we haven't had him out in a while. We're gonna save his points for Neural Shock. Okay. Okay. So there should be some Max coming out, which I'm right. Enemies inbound. Hostile Max. <laughs> Boom. <laughs> Boom. And that's it of them. Really? Oh. There we go. Check. There we go. Oh, there's a dead. Sorry. Way that way, so we'll deal with these. These pretty much tell you, oh, um, we're recalling all the mechs that we made here. There's no response from the Corsica that just picked up some mechs. Um, we're finding out that the mechs are now killing people. And now they're wanting to lock down the facility, but the Max already killed everybody, so... Said sometimes headshots are not the best way to kill Max. You gotta take it nice and slow here. Incoming. Down, bitch. Yeah. 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 
our forces have engaged. That is failure. Get these fuckers off one by one, that's what you gotta do. be all of them. I want that Ezo. I want that Ezo. It's going to drive me nuts if I don't get that Ezo. There we go. More Ezo. Okay, is that all that's in here? Yep. Just shut this down. Hack the panel to shut it down. We shut down the line. Not you. 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 All right, cool. So we shut down the facility and deactivated all the infected mechs. No new messages. All right. Well, we're going to look around, see if there's any more hidden... Um, Hidden quest to do. Because I want to explore all the galaxy that I can. Eagle. Okay, that's all of them. So now we can just, um,. So now I think I'm just going to call, call it for this video. I'm just going to head to this galaxy and I'm just going to call it for this video. So um, the next video I'll be helping Zaid and doing the uh, Firewalker missions. So this video has been is long enough. So anyway, hope you all had fun in this, in this episode. I did. And I will see you all in the next episode.